That right there is good stuff. Just got off work, got off a little early today. It's a nice uh, spring day. Gonna hit this creek over here. I've, I've fished it a couple times before and uh, I'm gonna try to get a few more places if I can and see if I can get any big uh, fish out of it. Oh, got a hit. Hey, the first catch. Oh, it came off. Yeah, oh, oh yeah. There's a good one. Get over here. Yes, oh man. Nice rock bass. <laughs> That's probably my biggest rock bass. That's definitely the biggest rock bass I've ever caught. Good, now he's living good in there. We'll get a measurement on him. Wish I had my scale to see what he weighed. Goodness, look at this mouth on this thing. Man, he's right at 11 inches, really close. Really close to 11 inches long. He's 10 and a half. 10 and a half inches long with a belly on it too. Yeah. Yeah, that's a nice one there. All right, I'm switching up to this uh, little crawdad with a weedless hook and an anchor on it. Uh, I'm gonna try dropping it in there and maybe give me a little better accuracy. That way I can dangle it, see if anything comes and gets it. Yep, there's one. Oh, that didn't take long. First cast under the bridge with this uh, crawdad. Got another uh, rock bass. He's a slim one. That other one I caught must be eating all this fish. But it's a long one though. Here's another one. I actually saw him come get it. It's a little bit. Another smaller rock bass. It's the third rock bass caught out of this little, uh, off the bridge. <laughs> Strong one. That's great. Big one up under the bridge I switched back to the uh, large crick hopper large rebel crick hopper and caught my first fish out of this hole it looks like a green sunfish let's face the camera the right way oh another muskrat this creek's full of them Hadn't popped up right in front of me. Oh, he's heard me talking. <laughs> hey! Oh, missed something. What was that? Something came out of there. There's one. Well, not the monster I was looking for, but the red breast sunfish. Oh, man. Something hit it again. Felt like it's a pretty good size. I gotta 
I hook at that thing. There we go. Oh, yes. There it is. Got him hooked this time. Ha. I got a six pound line on a five and a half foot pole. Got the drag set real loose. Woo! He's bigger than I thought. It's a fat little largemouth. Yeah. Look at the belly on that thing. No monster, but got to weigh over a pound. That's pretty fun to catch a little creek, little bass like this. Well, this is another spot that before I've caught all kinds of fish, I think last summer, and now I'm hardly getting anything. A little bit more skittish. Uh, got this uh, red breast sunfish. Nice one, nice pretty colors on it. Cut off the grasshopper. Yeah, this one here's a real pretty colored one. It's got a weird bony head right here. A little bit bigger mouth, but they're shaped like a bluegill. Using the smaller grasshopper. Cut this little shed. Holy cow, what was that? I missed it and it came jumping back for it while I was jerking. Let's see if we can get that thing again. There it is. Ha! That's what I missed. <laughs> oh. That's a good looking bass. Got it on the small grasshopper. I keep changing these things up. Sometimes one bites one, not another. Look at this stomach. What is that? Anyways, nice little largemouth. <laughs>